is something like the Chinese teams do a lot when they are against a push threat. They pick a core that can fight very, very early, have very good deep push. That's all DC are scared of right now. Like, I, I think like their team fight's good, their high ground defense is good. Like, they, they just they're gearing up in case LGD goes all in with the push, and it kind of shows Ten that way, leaning towards the Beastmaster, the Dragon Knight. Oh, oh, who's that guy? The Krothos by LGD. Five man Dakota. Oh, five five man. All right, Mech and Five Man. Dakota. Will the stampede of LGD be enough to just? Stop their way to a game three, then. It's like a minor thing, but that's pretty big for LGD to start the laning phase. Absolutely. He still is taking a fair bit of damage here in this mid lane for now, though. And Weeha just applying as much pressure as possible. But down bottom is where the action's going to happen, as there's going to be some right click as well as a rocket barrage. Misery gets stomped up, though, slept and still in trouble. Thunder Strike getting him low, and first blood goes the way of Banana. They're not done yet. The rocket barrage still doing some work, but it looks like that'll be the end of the that'll be the end of the trade. Though. Like, what maybe care about this, honestly? Orb of Venom Harass. He doesn't even have Janata. Shadow Walk does some work, but down bottom, the Rock Barrage will go as finally they've decided to turn aggressive and Resolution now getting caught out by the hero. Of course, it looks like he might get away. No, it, that Death Pulse, it's gonna hit him and he will fall. Magnetic Field, MMY, looks like he will get traded for Sox, however. Still, though, getting go under the tower. Stop not available for another eight seconds that he does. Get off that cold embrace to save his life. Let's keep on fighting. The whole body blocking coming out from misery. And they can't complete the kill after what seems like a 30 second chase. I mean, it's Wyvern Bounty Hunter. Like, Bounty Hunter is a decent roamer, an okay ganker, if you have a strong DPS hero, but. Who again getting caught. And now he will get the Necropose ulti, but it won't break him down. Timber chain away, right click, see if the reactive armor going, so he should be okay. But their main objective has been accomplished as we hot TP is in. Now the Elder Dragon form is done, maybe getting chased down. Starstorm, arrow, sidestep to get by, maybe nicely done, but still. Got the stick. He will actually use it, but it's going to be the Warlike death that brings it down. And Moo again, this time he gets back into the lane and he gets revenge for his death. Well, the rest of his team pretty significant, so we'll see how much damage they can get done with the Veil. Because it'll be coming out here pretty soon. They can start pushing top a little bit more aggressively. Misery and they have the they have the vision here. Yeah. They might be able to set up a glimpse if he's not careful. Static Storm's ready. Sentry is down. Shall I walk you forward looking for Aurora, but he'll get the glimpse back and now Misery caught in the trap of the kinetic field and he just gets at least right click down. You want mid lane? And go on him. And it looks like DK is gonna get caught by three, maybe. Not tanky enough to withstand a star storm. And well, three hero gank is really all that it takes for DC to bring him, bring him down. And they get the tier one tower for a victory as well. I think they actually walked a little too close to the tower, which uh, is why the smoke broke. Which I'll be fighting what's still smoke. Well, they're gonna throw out the chakram. Misery says, yeah, that's it. It looks like he's still only level five and he's stomped up now. Shall looking for a roar target? He'll find Soxa. They don't want that cold embrace. Here comes the Earth Splitter. They'll bring him down with the Necro ulti as well. 36 seconds down. Good. Static Storm. We are in trouble. The stop comes through as well, but aggressive getting chased down. Moo will find the kill. Moonlight Shadow on top. One for one trade so far. They have a sentry though. DC have to be careful about engaging into this. Gonna back out now. Moo on the other side. Arrow not gonna connect very close. Glimpse is ready. Anyone who overextends is likely dead. Misery might be the one. He's got his raindrops, might not save him. They have to come back like you talked about. Misery thunderstruck, and there it is. Brought back to the kinetic field and will drop as maybe gets the brief fire. That's more than enough to get the kill, but ah, to determine where they are. It's a blink dagger picked up by aggressive, and now the five-man continues for LGD. They'll push forward together. Yeah, there are important Dragon items coming out. Well, Sun they already Dragon. have that Elven Dragon form. There's the play in. They have got the stun. Soxa still has the Cold Embrace, and he's actually doing okay. It looks like they were ready for that. The glimpse, though. back, though, and even with that Cold Embrace, he might not survive, and he should fall to at least one more right quick, and it should be the case. They will take this tier 2 tower as well. Double damage room. They do not want to waste this on maybe. They might go top or right into this tier 3 tower mid. They've used Moonlight Shadow, but the sentry is down. It's not that far forward. It doesn't see DC heroes on the high ground. And Wyvern is a really important part of stalling pushes, though. The threat of a good winter's curse is really scary against Gyrocopter Timber Saw, but they don't find it. It's the Zelda you go in. We, uh, he's going to go down. That's the Necro ulti bringing him down. 62 seconds on the sidelines, and suddenly, no buyback. 
they have now gotten a secure lead and the tier three tower almost down. Like you said, no buyback, dead for 50 still. They will back up. Well, damage on DC. This is going to be very difficult to stop. They do find that kill somehow. That'd be great. Glimpse back coming in. Moves gonna... out of the fight. Yeah, he's gone. That's the difference still out of it. Now the BKB. Winner's Curse comes down aggressive, taking a lot of damage here, getting low, almost down. Death Pulse keeping him alive. You can see the right click coming in. They jump in, and there's the axe. Verona. We are getting the kill. Static Storm will off the mark right now. LGD has health for most of them. Moonlight Shadow not saving him. He's low. And now there's the big cold break. Saving his life, and Moo has arrived. Cleaning them up. He wants more. Timber Chain coming in. Stop. And I'll lock him down in place. Arrow coming through. Will it hit? And he just is able to make it away. The TP is going to be able to get him out of that bad position. Oh man, we have almost killed three, four heroes there. Almost dying as well. This Marana living a fairly in there. This could be a dream flank, or it could com be a complete train wreck. Mod the Hawk is to the north. There's not really much vision for LGD here. Unlike Shadow Sentry, they don't have it. They have the Necrobolt though. Now we're gonna get caught. Static Storm, nicely timed, but still the BKBs are there. Mid three pop first. Gold of Race on top. Alright, the footer coming out as well. It looks like Resolution might get caught. Great one is cursed to save him. Maybe he's still trying to bring him down, but he can't quite get there. Who in the Dragon Tail? He will finish him off. It's a dominating spree, but now Moo comes in, shot from there. There's the ulti keeping him alive. The Necro ulti actually saving him for a moment, but the DK will end up falling. Still going to be more damage. And now it looks like they're cleaning up. DC cleaning out. Moo is out of killing spree. He gets two. They've gotten a third with Doxa getting a double. Arrow hits up. Starts from damage. And DC rolling over side of LGD. That is a gigantic fight. That's a lot of track gold. So, big things that went wrong for LGD in that fight were complete airball on the Static Storm. Uh, they had to commit the Necrofo Assault just so that the DK could uh, armlet toggle there. It was the Beastmaster and Necrofo is even further behind, but only by a thousand. Who is doing his damnedest at this point with, like you said, the 17 Bloodstone charges. You see what he wants to go next? He might be saving up for that Blink Dagger, I would imagine. LGD are smoke. Gold. They're in the river. They're gonna clash, they're gonna find injury. Sentry's there, and they should be able to bring him down. Stun up the Dragon Tail. They blink forward, they're looking for more. Doxa, oh, well, actually, Arctic Burn out, only to get Glimpse back in and caught. BKB popped by Aggressive, they really wanted to get those two kills. They know kills mean Roshan, and that is what LGD want now. Or maybe they just want a tier two. They were thinking about the push in the bottom lane instead. They're gonna rotate into the pit. The Necro Book is gonna end very soon, though. But there is a buyback on Wyvern, but... I think otherwise he may have used it and found the Wyvern, but still they get that one pink mod, and now they look for their second They're lane of wreck. They found Moo, there's gonna be the jump in, they get the jump in with the Dragon Tail. Sentry's down again, not much detention here for LGD, they need more of it. Shackle's coming through, Moo jumps in aggressively, pushes back LGD. Did force out the pipe to get a glimpse. They're gonna find Moo, but now the damage under the maybe. Arrow comes through, they found him. Doesn't have the agent, he will fall. Dead for 16. Meteor Splitter slowing resolution down a little bit. Aggressive BKB now down. Starstorm, so much damage from Weeha. They have to kill him the second time. We'll see if they can, and they will be able to jump in. Tipper Chain is going to get destroyed. Oh my god, that glimmer. <laughs> just resolution glimmered away to safety. Survives the Necro ult there. The track comes out for misery. Who might be getting a Lincoln Spear? It potentially could be a hex, but. I think he's just worried about that Blink Dragon Tail or Roar punishing him when he split pushes. So if he gets a Lincoln Sphere, he's a lot more free to move around in the fights. There's options like Scotty, I suppose. I think it's. I don't think Manth is particularly great this game. Lucy getting chased down. Banana looks like he'll be the first fall, but on the other side, there's going to be the Dragon Tail bringing down Toxa. No more Winter's Curse available, but that BKB is falling slowly. They don't have the glimpse like LGD does, however. Static Storm. We have a walk through it. She's gonna protect him. On the other side, it looks like they have roared up, though. Two more damage coming through. You can see, look at how low maybe he is. He's about to fall. Move. Timber Chain up. We'll bring him down. Three dead. 63 seconds for him to be on the sidelines. And Timber Saw again. Move doing so much work in these fights. Now they have to go to plan B. That is this Aghanim Scepter and Aggressive.
you know, you know what that completed the smoke comes out from both teams here they're gonna meet each other in the middle of the jungle and it's a rumble in the jungle resolution found out first necro ulti not gonna kill him but it will bring him low he'll pop the bkb earth's gonna come out as well might connect resolution solo but lgd are the ones to back up and here comes moo here comes moo chakram the whirling death as well there's the winter's curse of banana and shall is killing his brethren banana not falling static storm it will miss misery as well as Worth Boo walking out. The Star Storm will break down one. Can they get two? Aggressive being pushed in the base. The Shuriken bouncing through. They just crowded them. D LGD. They again the Glimmer Cave phase from Soxa saving his teammate. We're just not seeing this Necrophos ulti. Net them kills. This Wyvern has been on point and he does it, having had a very rough start to the game. But LGD don't have vision. They have the track right now. Dragon Knight. Still LGD being forced to go in. At Death Pulse doing some damage. Aggressive backing up. Blink Roar, Misery caught. Green Fire. Good call to Brace to keep him alive. Maybe they will take the tier three, but can they get out? Misery. Winner's curse on the maybe. And now he's in trouble. The chakra put on where he stands. Right now, Static Storm missing again. And Lou continues to go crazy. And the roar is blocked by the Lincoln Spear. Xiaowei trying anything he has at his disposal, but he's down. He does have his buyback for resolution. Chasing after aggressive, he'll find him as well. Two buybacks, and they're both on those heroes. They do find the glimpse, though. They go tier four. Moo getting caught out. They might lose the Timber Soul because he bloodstone tonight. It doesn't happen. That's a thousand gold LGD's way. And aggressive is on the chase. Do they have another glimpse they at the ready? Out. DC now trying to run and escape. There's still eight seconds left here for him to respawn. So could TP in if he so chooses to, but at this point in time, it looks like they hear a fight. Still not that much damage, all things considered. Yeah, he has the level 3 Elder Dragon form MKB Mjolnir and Armlet, but really not enough. Resolution with the Satanic, scene. yeah. This is it. Obviously, the Necros are going to be popped a little early. Misery is going to start throwing these tracks out, but Shao is looking for him. And Misery might get dropped first, but the Necro OP is now gone. And everyone is still alive. Resolution, yes, he will lose that Aegis, but everyone's still healthy for DC after BKB's. Which is first comes down beautifully from Soxa. And it starts on right afterwards. Weeha will find a kill. On to maybe down for 80. No buyback as well. And Shelly getting chased out. This might be an LGD. Their tournament stake at live, uh, their lives at stake, excuse me. There's gonna be we are jumping in the stars from coming through. They want more blood and they want the racks. They want to face this off. And still no necro old here for 30 seconds. Party of lane caved in. Soxa to the rescue again. He glimmered there. They used the move pipe. And even though it was a very low HP, very under farm, well, not under farm, but relatively minimal farm bounty hunter. They still couldn't kill him at half health. This Necrophos is not far Oh no, Necro getting caught. The Star Storm 3 and the Chakram. Triple Star Storm. He has to buy back immediately. Lotus Roar picked up for the Bounty Hunter. Oh god, another way to punish the Necro. Also a way to deal with the Beastmaster potentially. They're gonna lose. And it might not even Brad. matter, Ma. This is two lanes. It might be it's gonna, three. Yeah, it's gonna be three. There's nothing they can do. DC are just gonna continue the pressure. This might be it for LGD. They've got to fight with one last gasp. It's so tough. They have Necro OP back up, ready to go. He's the Veil. And he jumps, jumps in with the BKB and Resolution is fine. What you doing, buddy? I've got Lotus, I've got Lincoln, I've got the BKB. You can't touch me, says Resolution. Maybe. It's too late. He's arrived, but the Raxes are gone. All sets of racks is down now for LGD as Baby respawns to find its base is broken. Him out, 2.6 gold, plenty of buybacks, but again, that ultimate from the Necrophos that can really cause havoc for DC. Still, this is gonna be, it's gonna take a miracle, I feel like, here, LZ for LGD. Oh god, now the refresher on Soxa. Ay, ay, ay. Jumps in, we have uh, Star Storm on just about everybody, but he is taking lots of damage. There still is that winner's turn. The first one, the Chakra, the second one coming out, and now all the damage coming through again. The Static Storm off the mark. Misery might fall, sure, but everyone else is dead. LGD will lose three, and that's it. GG is called. The 6 7 Giant from Europe.
MVP of this one. Toxa pulling out all the stuff to carry his team to victory from the four, five position support role. He keeps DC alive. Good overall showing by DC, but you just have to take your hat off for that Wyvern.